Hello, nerdlings. What is up, nerdlings? Do you nerd for robes and magic and muggles? Okay, maybe not muggles. <laughs> Do you nerd for Wizarding World boxes? Hey guys, it's Jazz from Nerdy Blation Cosplays, and you're watching Do You Nerd? All right, my dear, what is the theme of this? Well, World box? the sticker gives it away just a little bit on the box. It says the Department of Magical Transportation. Uh, I've not had the best luck of them. I had to go get my magical license reinstated after a magical DUI. <laughs> Don't have a butterbeer while you're going out on your broomstick. <laughs> <laughs> So, the theme is Department of Magical Transportation. Gear up to travel the wizarding world, whether by broom, train, or flying car. Go on a journey with this adventurous crate. Alright, first things first. A luggage tag. That's pretty on par for magically transporting. Yeah. This is the lock off of Newt Scamander's suitcase. It says, Muggle-worthy. Oh yeah, that was pretty sneaky, Newt. The uh, lock is metal, but the rest of it is kind of like a pleather on here. And then on the other side is where you put your name and address. So a good functional item. I and, love those. You know, kind of shows your, your geekiness, your nerdiness out there mm -hmm. without being too in your face. It's kind of one of those, it's like, hey, what's that? Does that say muggle worthy? <laughs> like Harry Potter stuff? In fact, one of the first crates we ever got from them, I think we got a platform and nine and three quarters luggage tag, and that is on my suitcase. So this will go on the other suitcase. <laughs> and now oh, we have an umbrella. Functional. We have Hagrid's pink umbrella. Nice. I mean, they made it nice and small, which I like. It would have been, I mean, obviously they wouldn't have been able to get it in the crate, but you know, his was the full length with the curved handle, but uh, let's, Let's see what's on this thing. On this side, it's just pink. But if you flip it over... Okay, maybe that's what I was seeing on the other side. You see Hagrid flying through the sky. Where'd he get that motorcycle? <laughs> that's pretty cool. It's a, you know, it's a good size. It's a nice, very small, compact, really probably easy to... Uh, carry in like your purse or your bag or something. Now, you were having some issues, technical issues with yes. it. We're gonna look into it and see. It does have some kind of catch in it, so I might contact the company and let them know that I might have a defective one. Because it occasionally will catch down here and it'll occasionally catch up there, but They've usually been pretty good about repairing things. Okay, so we'll look into that, and mm -hmm. if we have an update, maybe we'll toss uh, some information out there after the fact. Next thing we have in here is a Hogwarts Railway with the crest on it, and on the back you've got the Department of Magical Transportation uh, logo on it. I love these. I love these for my earbuds. Um, right. I still have a few old school earbuds with the cords on them, and uh, I love to wrap those up and put them in here. So I actually have quite a few of these, so now I'm excited to have a nerdy one of these. Whenever I look at the front, even though it's Hogwarts, and railways, all I can see is just like Hot Wheels. Something, uh, you know, like it does kind of look like a tire. Uh, it kind of takes me back to the old carrying cases for the Hot Wheels toys. Yeah. All right, we've got the button. Button time. The last few have been buildings, shops, and the like. So time to see if we're going to continue working on our little uh, cityscape. Yeah. Um. I was at first. I was going to say maybe it's going to be a phone booth because that's what they used to get into the Department of Magical Mysteries, but. I don't know if that's in that same building. 
Oops. Oh, nope. It's platform nine and three quarters. Oh, it's a button of a wall. Yeah, great. Thanks, guys. No, uh, even though <laughs> it's, you know, nothing like, like, ooh, ah, it's iconic. It is. I Everyone mean, knows what nine and yeah, three quarters yeah. is. And the wall's very iconic. Cool. It's got Hedwig on it, sitting on Harry's trunk, eyeballing that wall. You really gonna make me walk through that wall? Uh, as long as he actually goes through it, <laughs> unlike that one time. All right, the next item we have in here nice. is the night bus. And I like that. Like an old school tin metal lunchbox. That is adorable. It even has like the old school handle for the yeah, lunchbox. Yeah, it does. Too, the collapsible. Yep. That's pretty great. And it's a wrap around design. Yep. Bus, you've got it on the back. All destinations, nothing underwater. And then you've got all the different, the three levels in it. I was trying to see if you could see the shrunken head or Ernie, but uh, not so much. But it's pretty cool though. I really like that. This will go really well with my Lego night bus I just built. What you fall over for? I didn't do it on purpose. Come on then. Let's not wait for the grass to grow. The last thing we have in the box Ooh. is a Hufflepuff Quidditch scarf. So, uh... That's pretty nice. Yeah. You know, I like the low profile design to it. Mm -hmm. Like, it's not going overboard with any kind of Harry Potter logos, Hufflepuff logos or anything. It's very simplified. I like that it is kind of mirrored in mm -hmm. design as far as the way the H's look, as far as the way the brooms look. And it's got fringe. I love fringe. And inside the box, we've got a Nimbus 2000 advertisement. Ooh, it's here. It's finally here. Please inquire within. <laughs> According to this, everybody got their own house. Nice. Ooh, I do like that Slytherin one. Of course you would. You are a Slytherin. Yeah, but the, the green and the gray look so good. They really do. It does look really good. So everything arrived. Everything is no in there. No saying uh, we're going to send you something <laughs> whenever we feel like it. Okay, first of all, let's talk theme. Well, I honestly think they did a pretty good job with the theme because, you know, you've got a luggage tag, you've got the night bus, which is what you travel around on, or a lunchbox, which you would take food with you, an umbrella. I always highly recommend people take umbrellas when they travel, especially this one, because it's nice and compact. You can throw that in your backpack. And then, like I said, I keep my earbuds in those when I travel, but you can keep coins in it, anything to organize yourself with. And the pin for the wall. And the pin for the wall. And then a scarf to keep yourself warm. Try me on. I will tell you where you want to be. I think they did pretty dadgum good. And honestly, the quality of the items, other than the sticking of the umbrella, which it might just be a, you know, a, an oil issue. Might Maybe just need work to, it out. Yep, yeah, just been stiff. But the quality seems really great of everything. I'm pretty pleased with this box. This is a good one. Well, wow. looks like And they've been are, on time, so yeah, that's good. Yeah, they're doing pretty good. Good quality, good theme, on time. That's a big one. <laughs> All right, well, any final thoughts for your latest Wizarding World box? I'm still happy with them. Good. <laughs> that's good. That makes me <laughs> All right, nerdlings, please drop some comments down below on the things you like, even if there's things that you don't like. Let us know your thoughts on the functionality, the quality, the cleverness of some of these items, what you thought of anything. And please give the video a like if you happen to like don't it. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell. That's not a very good bell. <laughs> Better lunchbox than a bell, I hope. As well, don't forget... To like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, go over to Tee Public because we've got merchandise over there. Hit us up on the Retro Refresh, and hey, they've got merchandise on Tee Public as well. And if we like it, we nerd it. Especially for traveling. I don't know how I'm going to fit in this bus. Well, you know, Harry Potter, they, they have magical means. I bet if uh, 
put a cake in this and Hagrid sat on it, it would still be squished. It would probably still be squished. <laughs> Bye, nerdlings. <laughs> Bye -bye, nerdlings. Is, there, is there a trick? Does this open? Do I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to get rain done. Mm, yeah. Like, comment, and subscribe. You already said all of that. <laughs> all right, ready? Oh, no. <laughs>